the first step, and it, this is critical for just setting your mind up for it, is to quickly survey the section or the chapter that you were asked to read. And most books nowadays, especially uh, in the middle school and the high school, and even more so in the college level, have it added over time lots of pictures, lots of graphics with captions to give you an idea to, to grab or nab your interest. That's what surveying is. Quickly get a look at what you're about to read without actually just starting cold reading the assignment. You're to look at the picture, look at the, read the caption, and oftentimes you learn some pretty fascinating things. You think you're looking at one thing and all of a sudden it turns out it's something else completely. So it sparks your interest into why you want to read this section. It gives a purpose and a focus for what you're reading. It gives you an idea what the topic is about. And so, especially if you're at an intro to a science class, it might be things about what do scientists investigate? How do they use the scientific method? Uh, and what are the types of sciences that you might find? And so it gives you a purpose. Before you even read the first sentence on the first page, it gives you a focus for what you're reading. And your mind now knows what the topic is going to be. Parents can get involved by asking the students, well, I see that you have an SQ3R assignment. And um, can you look at the pictures and, and show me the captions? Maybe show me what was your favorite picture in the section that you were going to be reading. What was, the, what was the key thing that you found fascinating? What piqued your interest? 